That's it. Here we are at Wizarding World of Harry Potter, yeah. and are you a roller coaster guy? I am. I love all this stuff, being thrown upside down and spun around and throwing up. It's great. Yeah. What, the more um, extreme the experience, the better, as far as I'm concerned. What have you... Uh, what did you experience in the castles and such? Well, I'll tell you what I found very surprising. I haven't been to this, uh, the Wizarding World of Harry, Harry Potter before, but all the rest of the cast have. They told me it was great, and I thought, I guess they're just saying that to be kind of ambassadors for the thing. You know? And I expected it to be some kind of cheap, plasticated version of the real thing. But in fact, it's better. It's extraordinary in there. I mean, it was, the whole thing felt, you know, it really was Dumbledore's office. It really was a great hall. But also, uh, it felt like Dan and Rupert and Emma were on the balcony talking to me. There's a whole bunch of kind of holographic 3D things. You know, I'm not, a, I'm not trying to sell tickets for it, but I was amazed by how good it is. It's cool, yeah. Yeah. Now, um, have you been to the Harry Potter Museum? I have not. I didn't even know. Does it exist? What is that? It's in the works, and I, oh, know, okay. that, I know they're taking some things. There's traveling exhibits, I know, because one of the reasons I, w I never got any of my wigs, which I was so keen to take home, is because I understand they're all on tour somewhere, like the Rolling Stones. That's what I wanted to ask you, if, if there's something that is in the museum that you might have wanted to keep. I don't know. I didn't even know it existed, but I'll have a look, and, uh, and if necessary, I will shatter one of the ex exhibition cases and see if they can chase me down. Are you going to miss the fans at all? I don't know what I'm going to miss because it hasn't happened yet. It's not over. Uh, we're all being asked what we're going to miss in the future. Uh, and I think the other people are tending to try and give answers. But it's a ludicrous question because we don't know what we're going to miss in the future. Right now, it's still all going on. We're here. We're gathered here. We're having a lovely time with each other. And, and uh, all the fans are out there going nuts. And, uh, and, you know, who knows what the future will feel like. I certainly don't No British actor I've ever met became an actor or does the job for uh, the interaction with the fans of the public. It's a strange bit of, you know, it's a side benefit in this. It's nice to see how much pleasure it gives. But what we really love is the stuff that the public don't see, which is telling the stories. It's going to the set, working with each other, and trying to create something fabulous to watch. And that's the bit that I do. And so uh, I'm not going to miss that because I'm still doing it. And what, what about, like, a favorite fan story that, that you can share? Uh, well, I tell you, one of the things that doesn't come across on the screen is in Trafalgar Square, lots of really fabulous young people gathered from all over the world and camped out for a few weeks in Trafalgar Square in, in order to be at the front of the railings when we went by. And it was really overwhelming, you know, the tens of thousands of people. And they all wanted a hug and a photograph, and I was out there for hours, as we all were, doing our best. And one of the things that uh, photographs don't really capture is quite how badly they reeked. You know, if you sleep rough in Trafalgar Square for three weeks, and uh, there are no bathrooms nearby. You can imagine the uh, ensuing results. So that's one of the things I won't miss. It's Unwashed like, fans. It's like Occupy Wall Street that's going yeah. on in New York. Yeah. So you wouldn't do it? Uh, would I camp out? Actually, we nearly went down to the Occupy uh, LA march the other day with my kids to explain to them what it was about. It's an interesting movement, I think, since it's so, at the moment, so unfocused with such unspecific goals. But it might be the beginning of something uh, truly remarkable. We'll have to wait and see. Well, great to see you. Thank you. Nice to see you. Have fun. Get on a ride. Get on the Hulk. You'll oh, love the yeah. Hulk. Oh, it's fantastic. <laughs>